<laughs> Transition! There we go. Boop. We have Zero versus T Lock Zone Dency. Uh, we're moving into this. This is Winner Semis. Now, let's go into this next one. You're going to see both these guys opting for some Diddy action. Let's get ready for oh, some Oh, I just realized. So, yeah, we're, you know, <laughs> since Aerolink lost, mm -hmm. we're going to get to see a Diddy Ditto between two of the best Diddies in this house here. Oh, yeah. These are two of the best Diddies in the business. Yeah. I mean, Dency definitely representing. Um, but Zero, man, I don't want to be messed with. So. Good claps on him there. Okay, interesting. Um, so is there... Okay, they're spacing them out. They're looking to see if they can get out that peel. Now, you're going to see him use that peel to try to either push them out, get a hit, hit stun opportunity, and try to get that mix up there, or chuck it down for positional advantage. Both of these guys opting to grab one. Now, that, granted, they also can use each other's peels as well, so who knows? Maybe you might get a bit uh, extra advantage. Setting up with another peel uh, right within vicinity. Wow, and I like how Zero was trying to set that up just for a forward smash. He literally just kept... Oh, and <laughs> then he went for the same thing. <laughs> These guys know that, Matt. These guys know how to play their game. Yeah. They definitely know. That's the setup right there. Good from the peanut. He was able to get a fair follow-up. Good stuff by Zero taking the first stock. Oh, no, whoa, Zero. <laughs> 41. That was a cool combo. No matter how much people may hate this character, I have to say that was an insane combo. Oh, for sure. Like, every time I see Zero play, he just does new things with this character every time. It's okay. Catching him off the top rafters. That's going to be the stock right there. Keeping it consistent. Let's see how this neutral plays out. Now, Zero. Uh, already, oh, I was about to say he was doing a good job of not getting grabbed. Whoa, and Zero, the person who taught many of us how to DI the down throw up airs, gets hit by three of them. <laughs> Chuck that peel, not gonna have it. Clapping on him, looking for that next setup. Not gonna be enough to take him off the top though. Are we gonna see an up throw up air from either of these players? <laughs> I just feel up throw and oh, oh! Drop down it. throw now. Wow, the di from both of these players impeccable. Oh yeah, because they're, they're well aware of each other in way. Oh. Whoa! Did you see that? He almost got forward smash and a reverse up air. What? Stopped it. Reverse. Reverse. He's gonna come in. How's he gonna stop him? Claps on him. Nice clap. Yeah, he can't stay there. You know, Zero could have actually down smashed there. And yeah, because it, it hits down. Uh huh. Uh -huh. If that hitbox is a little bit further down, how is he gonna get onto him though? Up there air. There it is. Mm -hmm. Good job by Zero. All right. And Zero takes game one. Zero being Zero, man. How is Denti going to cope? That is the question. Hmm. What do you suggest, man? You, it's definitely you've a race. seen a lot of this particular character, so tell me, what it, what do you do in those situations? Like, the tools that you're going to see a lot of these players go, um, use in neutral is like down tilt, fair, and then the occasional grab, and if anybody has like a, you know, like a banana peel, they'll toss it in there. But most of the time, the most non-committal approaches are like fair and down tilt. Mm. And once they go in, that's when you see like the big things happen. Like you'll see the grab. Right now, if either of these guys stand still for a second or shield, that's when they get grabbed. And also just make a mistake when it comes to approaching, which you see Zero capitalizing really well oh, on Dempsey's approaches. And don't forget the, the peanut pop gun as well from afar. Oh, yeah. Okay. Good <laughs> tail wagon. <laughs> All right. He's showing that old school Goku tech. Not bad. These guys keeping it close. I like it. Double back up, but the banana drop right there by Dente allows him to escape uh, the Zero's pursuit. Okay, coming back in, back in neutral. They're both looking for those grabs. Wow, Dente just made it. That was great. Smart. He knew that he wanted to, you know, see if he could play the aggression. Wow. Okay, Are Dente. You serious? Wow. Nice down smash. Probably expected a forward smash, but not bad at all. Using that side B to get a little bit of horizontal movement, getting that fair, pushing him on him though. Right now, we're seeing Denti having positional advantage. How is he going to use it? Gets the peel out. And I like the fact that he didn't go into water because if he missed, then that would give Zero the opportunity to try to see if he can spike him <laughs> or even hit him. Oh! Whoa! Okay, no, we're alive. We're alive. All right, all right. <laughs> oh, my God. That was an insane moment right there. <laughs> D1 and I were about to break mics. <laughs> if that head works, <laughs> rip earphones. Rip. All of them. Sorry to everybody who has headphones as well. Oh, this is ridiculous. Okay, he's coming in. Wow, that was so sneaky by Zero. Down throw. Still gets the fair, but not quite enough for the KO. Oh, he banged it to the wall. <laughs> and now these guys. 
Oh, man, that was a violent moment. It couldn't be seen on camera. Too hot for the stream. <laughs> <laughs> it would have broke the oh! oh! Yo, caught him with that forward throw. He said, you know what? Let's just chuck this full spiral monkey. Just threw him out there. That was really good. Nice. He brought back his old football days. It was real good. But now he's trying to get those setups and continue to push him out. Right now, Denti trying to see if you can keep Zero off the ground here. Oh, I like that by Zero. Opting for the back air. And going for the rolls. You can't turn around immediately after getting, like, after an opponent down tilt. So right. that's why you see players try to roll behind Diddy. Oh! oh. Pushing him closer to the blast zone on the left side. This is a walk off. He needs to be careful. He needs the peel, try to stuff him out. And I like how he tosses the uh, banana peel downwards, waits to see where Denti goes, and it follows. And here's the... Oh, that nice. That shield grab led into a good positional advantage. He's going to see if he can follow up. Fair. That entire time when I saw Zero pummeling, I thought he was going to set up for a forward throw. But so regardless, Denti the eyed that accordingly. Oh! oh! See, and that's, that's why jump canceled banana peel tosses are so good. He jump canceled that, had no lag afterwards, and got the fair. That looked... Beautiful. God. Banana toss down to fair. This is ridiculous. <laughs> this is ridiculous.